Well, here's the latest on the Ruby Deer near Waynesville. Last served value was 10.65 feet at 6.30. Well, that was an hour ago. The flood stage is 7 feet, and it's uh, beyond 10 feet now. I'm out here in Lebanon, Missouri. Came out here two years ago and killed my first eastern turkey. It's like being in high school. There's a girl that you like, you know, she gives you her number and you go home or, or you wait till she's out of sight and you just kind of do one of these. It's the same thing when you're walking through the woods, you hear a turkey gobble. <laughs> Instantly my heart just doo -doo 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 -doo. couldn't control my emotions. I was shaking out there. And at that point, like that's when I understood why people turkey hunt. This week there's record flooding in Lebanon. This morning we hunted and we crossed this creek and I could have crossed it wearing sandals. And now flash floods coming through Missouri all the way up until midnight tonight. I don't know how deep it is right now, but if I jumped in, I'd be gone in a heartbeat. Field that we killed my first bird in two years ago, for whatever reason, it just always seems to hold turkeys. Those birds are going to be looking at you. For whatever reason, something switches in on them. And those toms, they'll come in because they don't want you there. They're detailing it right for you. They're coming to kick your ass. Missing a turkey, man, it sucks. And when hunting's hard and you get an opportunity and you don't capitalize on it, it, it just hurts. It's hunting. You're going to have to put in a lot of time. You're going to have to put in a lot of effort. You're going to have to put on a lot of miles. It might be the last hour, it might be the last minute, it might be the last day, whatever it is. Something's going to change and as long as I can keep persevering out there, you know, I'm going to make it happen. You wake up and you, and you look outside and you don't hear the rain and you're just thinking, okay, hoping that it'll hold off just long enough so the birds are going to hit the field and they're going to be able to hear your calls and be able to work for you. If you can hear them spit and drum and you can feel it in your heart, you know that they're close. When you see him, you know, come out strutting like that, your heart's gonna drop. It 
It's been a rough go out in Missouri, you know. The weather sucked, thunderstorms, lightning, record floods. It, it's tough, so to seal the deal on the last day, it, it feels awesome. Speaking turkey to them, you know, you got to make the right call, the right time, you got to speak their language. 